Hello everyone, and welcome to, I guess, possibly the final edition of The Inner World. So, last time we left off, well, crap hit the fan, Laura and her father had been petrified, and as far as we know, Robert and Conroy are the only ones left still sucking air. So, yeah, let's try and figure a way out of this. Now, I've not played this in uh, just about a week, so this is going to be interesting getting back used to the control scheme of this. My stomach is also rather upset right now, so this might be a shorter session than usual, so let's get going before it gets any worse. The bazillion's brain is in there. That was an interesting noise, but open it. Locked. Okay, what about the other thing? Not a bad way to travel. I think I'll call him Fido, or Rex, or I should probably focus on saving the world. Can you take anything from inside of it? Ah, I will never get it out like this. Get what out? What are you trying to get out? Oh, oh, I didn't even see that. I don't want to know how the landing would have gone without this. I think you already know how it would have went. It'd been funnier. Probably would have been game over, though. It's securely attached to the bazillion. Well, how am I supposed to get it out, then? Do I have an item that would cut it loose? I don't have anything, do I? Oh, crap. Okay, pick up the shield, finally. Great, I guess. I don't know how the hell a shield's gonna cut it, but cut it! Well, I could, but I won't. Hmm. Well, I guess I can go look around other places. Okay, I, I was gonna say, no, I can't not go to there, but I can. Is there anything in the flower bed besides dead flowers? A bed of wilted nut trees. The world's getting darker and darker. Yes, but how did they die? You didn't land in it. And I don't think plants die that quickly. Unless, like, there's no sun, but these things don't require sun to live anyway. I mean, do they, they, do they thrive on wind? But the wind's still there because we're still sucking air, so I don't understand how this works. No, they're not alive anymore. Oh, whatever. Let's go look in this side first. Because I remember this place was rather important, so maybe there's something important here now. Oh, there's a sleeping phosphos. A sleeping phosphos. Poke it. Well, that's not exactly what I meant for you to do, but hell, I guess it'll work. Hey, you're that bastard I tried to catch since the beginning of the game. Peck, where did you come from? Come on, let's go save the world. Does Peck have anything? I guess he does. It's an old fish. What the hell is that supposed to help me with? It stinks, and Peck's constantly staring at it. That's the fish from the beginning of the game, isn't it? That's kind of funny. I didn't think we'd ever see that again. Looks like I, I can only examine the things, like those things up there. Now I guess I can't examine the things over here, to the right. It looks like a hook. What does? The thing he's holding? It looks like a, like the, the thing called a bugle, like the things you eat to me, but alright. I can't use that. Aspersions were. Maybe I have an uncle or an aunt that I never got to know. Don't worry, I will save you all. Right, so that didn't really do anything. Can I do anything with the hook? Wait, the hook? I don't see no damn hook. Do you see a hook? I see a, a cylinder type kind of thing. You can hang something on it. What I hang on it? A fish? I know you can- I, do they put fish on hooks? Or I'm, I'm thinking of beef, aren't I? Yeah, I watched too much Rocky in my life. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Jump on it, because you see a hook. I don't see no damn hook. I don't know, throw a fish on it. Why should I do that? I think you can hang fish, I don't know though. Hang peck on it. Well, I could, but I won't. Can you hang the shield on it? That thing was hung on the thing outside. Why should I do that? I don't know. I'm just trying things. Well, I... Okay, nothing with the hook right now. 
the symbols on the rings are the notes to the wind anthem. Yes, I'm aware of that. I solved that puzzle already. What's the thing on the top? I can't see what the thing on the top is. Could have at least put the text where people could actually read it. Just saying. These are the rings with the notes. They start turning when I play the song with my nose. <clears throat> okay, well, let's test that out. Uh... Was that not the... Oh, I'm... Okay. Okay, damn it. It's hard to see from this far away. Uh... Oh, damn it. I, anyway, I don't... Oh, shit, I guess I might as well try it. I won't continue this song until my family is alive again. Okay, well, at least I solved that. That is not what I'm supposed to be doing here. Is there anything else in here I can even look at, examine, or do anything with? It doesn't appear that I can, so I think I've gotten pretty much everything I need in here, unless there's something back here. Which there is not, so I guess I'll go back the other way now, because there's nothing else in here that I can do anything with. So can I do anything with the parachute with any of these? I don't think Peck will be much use. I don't think that will work. Fish ain't gonna do much. Could be fun. And I don't think the sleeping phosphorus -phos will do anything with it. A little phosphorus -phos is all by itself in the parachute. Okay, I can kind of understand putting it in a bed type thing, but what in the hell is that going to do with anything? <laughs> what? What did that accomplish? Well, I could. That won't. No. Nothing really accomplished yet, but I set something up to be accomplished, I guess. It's securely a little phosphorus. Hmm. That's just a random. Yeah, the random the phosphorus was a random guess too. That could be fun. Okay, so let's go look in the other thing on the left first. The reception area, I forgot what it was called, but yes, let's... Yeah, hey, you're still here. How you doing? Not the gumballs. Well, I guess I could probably take the gumballs. That's probably what they want me to do, but no. Talk to the man. Know the man. Here we go. Hello, Steve. Uh, Pete. Uh. Hello, how are you, Your Grace? What can I do for you? Why didn't you call me that before? Why are you calling me your grace now? Because the player knows? Well, that's just poor storytelling. We have to save the dynasty. I don't know what you're talking about. The family's doing wonderfully. Just yesterday, Ocarino Gustus II told me what a great job I'm doing here. Come on, Steve. Wake up. What kind of nonsense are you talking about? Pete, stay out of it! Oh, man. So he's not going to be any help. I, I don't know why I even thought he would be help. Why is the Phosphos yeah. dead? Well, thanks for your help. Anytime. And I say that because this thing, I think, is dead. Okay, it's sleeping, too. <laughs> Only putting a bunch of Phosphos in the parachute, and when they wake up, they'll, like... Burn it all out. I don't know what the hell I'm trying to do here. I can go outside, but I'm going to trust my theory on the phosphorus and see if I'm supposed to put that in the thing as well. I don't know why it would, but hell, maybe I'm right. I didn't think the first one would go in there. Two little phosphorus are laying together in the parachute. That's nice, but I'm really still not sure what the hell you want me to do with that information. It's securely attached. Considering none of these, the only thing I could even uh, halfway consider would be the shield could reflect light. However, they're underneath the blanket or the parachute, so that's not going to work. So I don't know. I guess I got to look outside, see if anything's going on out there that's new. Because there's nothing really else in here except the gumballs, but I don't think he'll let me take the gumballs. Hell, I could try it. Where did these gumballs come from? And what happened to the cookies? There are no more! 
Since someone tried to mix glass splinters, rust and stone dust with my blender. Chewing gum is great. I like how Robert just try and kind of ignores what he what was said there to try and maintain innocence. I'm surprised he let me take Ouch. the gumballs. They're hard as rocks. What happened to the soft cookies? There are no more since someone tried to mix glass splinters. Who would do something like that? Must have been Laura. Yeah, I bet it was Laura. She's always uh She's always just messing around with people's things. You know how she is. Yeah, that's how it is. Don't hey now there's leaving Foss Foss. Still not sure what in the hell I'm trying to do with that, but okay, how you doing? That's Gorfalina. If all female goths are like her, it's no surprise they're almost extinct. You realize you're like two feet away from her and she's looking right at you paying attention to what you're saying, right? I mean it would have made more sense if that was like a thought, but you just said it out loud. Have you seen the huge bazillions? Sure. One of them gave me a weird look and I gave him a piece of my mind. And you weren't turned to stone? <laughs> no. I won't let those ugly hairy brutes turn me into stone. Wow, you're really brave. But I would let you turn me to stone. Right. Maybe later. Okay. Uh, yeah, let, of all things, let's just bring up bad breath. Actually, let's just try and be a little jovial at first. How was your day? A little lonely, but quite nice. I picked an argument with a mosquito earlier. And? It's decomposing in my stomach. The little bugger is giving me bad breath. You can't smell it, can you? No, no, no. So, you can. I knew it. Is it bad? It's hardly noticeable. Yeah, let's just, uh... Let's just tell her how bad it is, because for some reason it's probably the right thing to do. Bad breath isn't so bad. Just brush your teeth. No, the brush must be made from stainless steel. It was nice oh, you. stainless steel. Okay, but okay. Okay. To be fair, I thought that'd be the same dialogue. I'll, I'll do that again just to see what it was. It was nice chatting with you. I agree. You're welcome to visit me again. Okay, but alone. Oh. Uh, he is alone. But okay, so that at least answers that question I had earlier. Why didn't her? Acid eat away at the shield itself. Maybe that's because it's stainless steel. So therefore, she needs to use the shield to brush her teeth. I don't know. No, now is no time to fool around. I, I'm just trying an idea, okay? You gave me the idea. Don't tell me not to try it. <laughs> I mean, what the hell is the point of it then? I don't suppose she'd want any of this, but hey, you give her a gumball. You want some gum? Sure, give it here. That's nice, but, uh, okay. Why should I do that? Why should I do that? Ah. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the bubble, though. I gotta wait till she blows another one. That could be take. That could be. That could sound wrong. Taken out of context. For God's sake. Why should I? I don't know. Why do you do anything you do? There has to. Excuse me. Been a reason why I gave her the gum. I need to try and logic this out because that's worked well for me every other time, right? I don't. I could. No, it will only make my hands sticky. Well, I, I, I said something else up now just to try and put things together, though I don't think that's going to work, but uh, I set something else up, I guess. Yay. So I got another sleeping Foss Foss, but I don't think three will fit in there, so I'm not really sure what in the hell I'm supposed to be doing with the third one. Three little Foss Foss in the parachute. 
three little phosphors are lying in the parachute. Yes, you just said that twice, as a matter of fact. I'm not really sure why you felt the need to elaborate further, and you're still not going to allow me to do this. It's secure. Hmm. Ah, I will never get it out like this. Do I need to use a tool? Like, use leverage. I don't think that will work. I didn't think it'd work either, but maybe this thing will help. That won't work. Oh yeah, I already tried that, didn't I? Damn it. Don't tell me I'm stuck again. Man, this happens too much. I just had an idea after a couple minutes that what woke up the false false before? I'm an idiot. What woke them up before was playing the flute. Aha! So now I can get inside of the thingy which is a release button, so let's push that bad boy. Probably shouldn't push random buttons unless I know what they do. Okay, so that was not exactly great, but I need those depetrifying eyes. Ha! Ah. Do I really need them? I, I don't know. But I got them now, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Now the release button, where'd that fire at? That fired... Mm, doesn't work. I guess I'll never know now. I guess that was just one of those one and done type things. So I got depetrifying eyes. Oh. Damn it, I can't depetrify them. Maybe I can depetrify the guy outside. Maybe he knows what the hell to do. Just working on this, I don't think that's what you're supposed to do either, but I gotta give it a shot. I think if that was going to work, though, he would have at least been targetable. I guess he is targetable now. <laughs> why should I do that? To depetrify the man. What the hell you mean? Why should I do that? You dumbass. I put it together with my own hand. I won't break it again. I don't think the uh, eyes are supposed to. No, no. I didn't think so. Well, I solved one thing, and now I'm back to square two, out of like ten. Damn it. I don't think this is going to work, but hell, I've, I've run out of ideas. What? Oh, damn it, now that doesn't work. <sighs> Why? Why do you not try random things before, Balrock? Mm, doesn't work. Oh, right, 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 right. You need this. Aha. Uh -huh. Sweet. Uh -huh. God, I can't reach the petrified aspersions with the beam. I can't help them. Well, do it again. Maybe you'll bust down the wall and it'll be funny. Darn, I can't. Okay, so just like change the angle on the shield. Maybe I should turn it a little. I think that's gonna hit something else, but yeah, do that. Try that. Yeah, that's what I pictured would happen. You, you turned it the wrong way. Maybe I should turn it a little. Uh, I think that would hit you, so this will be funny. Let me save beforehand. I think that's gonna hit you, Robert, so this, is, this should be funny. My gosh, that could have gone very wrong. <laughs> oh, the brain. That's... You can never have too many brains. That's great, I guess, but now who knows if that thing still works. Maybe I should turn it a little. Uh, you don't turn it any further than that, do you? Darn, I can't... Hmm... Bullet hole? Well, I could. I can't do... Well... What the hell's a bullet hole? Is that where the thing hit? Darn, I can't reach the petrified aspersions with the bee. Hmm... I can't do anything with that. 
Because you can't turn the shield the proper way. Maybe I should turn. No, that's just gonna hit the other thing. Maybe I should turn it a little. I don't think blowing its head off again will do much, but it'll make me feel better. The... I almost killed myself on that the last try. I won't try that again anytime soon. That was the point of it, to be funny. Maybe I should. But can I do anything to help reflect it again? I don't have anything that will reflect it again. Off the top of my head, anyway. Unless. Unless. What's that over there? Oh, alright. I can't use that. Did anything change in the wind chapel? Because I blew up half the wall? Not really. There's nothing else in here, so this is pointless. Is there anything in here now that I cracked this wall? Not really. Can I take the mirror? Oh, the mirror. Hey, stop it! You, you're not getting the mirror. Give him the mirror. No! Mm. And that's final. Crap. Well, anyway, I'm going to let you in on my la my new theory, my last theory here before we go for today, because it's been about 25 minutes. My stomach's starting to not feel very good. My thought was if I can get uh, the mirror, hang that bad boy here, reflecto, prezzo, presto, reflecto, I don't know what the hell. Anyway, then that would free them, and then, we'd, yeah, that's what I was trying to do there. So next time, I'm going to try and get the mirror from old Stevie. I don't think it'll work. I might be on the wrong path, but this is what I'm going to try and do next time. Which I guess will be Tuesday tomorrow, so yeah. Thank you guys very much for watching and putting up with my blundering. And thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Farewell, everyone. Until then.